gets really hard out there. My life was homeless. It was theft, doing the nastiest things just to get my fix. And it was never enough. I've been in a shelter since April of last year. It's been a struggle on the street for a long time. I had a girlfriend when we got separated. I was here and uh, she was still out on the street um, using and stuff like that. It just kills you. when people are at their most vulnerable is when it is so encouraging for someone to be able to reach out and say, how can I help? And that's what the Salvation Army does. The Salvation Army is a Christian organization that really is faith in action. Our opportunity to journey with the overlooked people in our society so that we can help make a difference. Last year, the Salvation Army was able to support 1.8 million Canadians. That's a lot of people in our country who are putting their hand up looking for support, looking for assistance, practical ways in which the Salvation Army is helping. I would like to thank the Salvation Army. I have a place now to call my own. I'm moving in today. It feels amazing. It's been so long since I've been out in a shelter and it feels so nice to have your own place call home, to go home to, to feel comfortable. Well, I graduated the program, and there's a second stage uh, treatment. Like, I live with four other guys. It's the beginning of starting your life all over again, getting out into the community, getting a job. Being there uh, when people are facing some of the most devastating times in their lives and being able to come alongside and grow together. Um, that, is, that is an honour for us and a privilege, uh, one that we don't take lightly. I'm a much better person now. I actually love myself. When you don't love yourself, you, there's nothing there, you know? How could uh, you love somebody else when you don't even love yourself? You know, we're going to be getting our own place soon and uh, building our lives. The Salvation Army is most known for being able to provide food, uh, shelter, and clothing. We also provide life skills training and employment training, skills that can enhance them in helping them find a job to help them break the cycle of poverty. We offer services for children, um, such as childcare and playgroups. We offer services for parents, whether it's assistance with basic needs or all the way to looking at your employment and your education. It gives me a chance to better my life for my children. They look after your kids when you're here, you're allowed to go and see them and then go back and continue your work in the class. That is very important to me. It's also important to have such positive people like the staff members here helping and supporting your dream. It's rewarding, um, inspiring people and helping them grow towards their goals. Some people, they don't have other support at home and to come to this community center and get the support, this place really helps you. They have hope for the future because they can see that future, they can see that, uh, that success and it's not so far away. It just put hope in me, a lot of hope in me. There's crisis in everybody's lives and sometimes you have it all and then next thing you know you have nothing and the Salvation Army is there to help you. It's been a wonderful feeling of uh, being helped like this. From being a homeless person to a person that has a home now. It's amazing feeling. I don't know if I'm going to go back to school or if I'm going to go back, uh, get a, find a job. But now I can go for it. We can't do this alone. The Salvation Army relies on the support of our generous donors, our key community stakeholders, and our enthusiastic volunteers who help make it possible for us to help some of the most vulnerable people in our communities. And it is in that spirit that we want to say thank you 